This is a survey question and it's asking people what beverage do you drink in the morning? They could say coffee only, tea only, both coffee and tea, or neither coffee nor tea. So we need to draw this table and I'm gonna zoom out a little bit here. All right, so we have coffee, tea, and none or neither. All right, 20 report tea only. So that it's not the entire circle for tea. Tea only is tea and not coffee. So it's only this part right here. So that's where our 20 goes. It's only for tea. 64, coffee only. So again, that's not the full coffee circle because we don't count coffee and tea. Coffee only, 64. 52 report both, 52 in the middle. And so for none, how would we get none? We need to know the total, 180 total. And how many do we already have here? 64 plus 52 plus 20. Uh, let's see, four and two is six. 116, uh, 126, 136. So we have 180 total. We've accounted for 136. So there's 44 left over. That would be 180 minus 136. So there's 44 for none. All right, how many people drink tea in the morning? So tea in the morning, it's not just that 20 that was given, but it's also the 52. So 20 plus 52, you add those, you get 72. How many people drink coffee in the morning? Really similar, except you're adding those two numbers together. Uh, 116. How many people drink neither tea nor coffee? That's that none that we just computed. 44. And that will be uh, all we need to do for this chart. Now, when we were building this up, to, I'm gonna go back to the beginning. You don't need to erase your chart. Your chart's great. Uh, if it said 20 reported T, not T only, this only is really important, but if that's not there, 20 reported T, that means 20 are gonna be between these two. We would need more information to know how many go in here and how many go in here. And if that only was missing, 64 report both. That would be here and here added together. And for the both, we could finally, we'd write that down, 52, although that number would have to be smaller. Let's pretend it was like 12 or maybe even 10. So if those both are gone, the way we would do this, we'd put 10 reported both there. Now, 64 report coffee. So that would mean 54 are here because 64 is total coffee. And 20 total T, so 10 and another 10, that puts 20 inside of the T circle. So when it says the word only, your question's a little bit easier. If it says the word only, you can just write the numbers in. If it doesn't say only, you gotta go to the inside most part and then work your way out. And it's a very different way to build it but the final, once you have all these numbers and answering the question, it should go in a similar way.